calling in and popping in and popping Ooh. out. I have a caller, area oh. 646. I hear you coughing and clearing your throat. Please go ahead and speak. Area Hello. code 646, go ahead and speak now. Uh, my name is Tracy. I'm calling in from the Middle East. And I oh just want to say to Costella, I love your music. Uh, you Aww. have a smooth and sultry voice. Your energy radiates through your music and your lyrics. <laughs> and I just want to say congratulations, and you're doing a phenomenal job, my friend. Oh, thank you, Tracy. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, thank you so much for so that. Uh, He's in the Middle East. Wow, thank you. It's, it's 4.16 a.m. here, and I had to wake up early just to uh, oh, dial okay. in. I wouldn't, wouldn't miss this for anything. Oh, oh well, man. thank you for calling in. Wow. <laughs> oh. I feel so special. So you thank you, Tracy. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, my friend. All, All right. right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thank you. We have another caller. Um, it's area code 812. Go ahead and state your name and speak now, please. Area code 812. Speak. Hello. Hello. Go ahead and speak now. <coughs> Hello. Ah, uh, yes. All right. Am I on? Yes, you are now. Speak now, please. The time is going. Hi. Uh, my name is Cheryl. Hello, Cheryl. <laughs> hey, and, girl. And I, uh, I have a special place in my heart for this young lady uh, because uh, she is my sister-in-law. Yes, yeah, I've my been knowing. <laughs> I've been knowing this young lady for a long time. For matter of fact, I'm actually married to her brother. Uh, yes, we yes. live here in Evansville, Indiana. So we yes. would not miss this for the world. I've yeah. been knowing Kathy or Costella, excuse me. <laughs> uh, we actually went to college together. That's where I first met her at Long Beach State University. Uh, yes. And I, she spoke about singing in the church. She had uh, uh, her lungs, let me tell you. Uh, I loved hearing her sing. She actually sung in our wedding. And I'm going to tell you right now, she is going to be on top of the charts. I'm going to follow you all the way, Costella, and I'm going to be <laughs> Thanks, rooting sis. for you all the way. And I just can't wait to see what you do with yourself. I'm just, I mean, I can't wait. We are excited right. about what you're doing and where you're going. God is going to bless you, and we're going to be here to see every bit of it. God bless you, and we can't wait to see you. Your brother standing right here. And we are listening in. Brenda, God bless you for bringing her into our hometown. She's oh, on the West Coast. My we pleasure. can't get to her right now. Uh, so thank you for bringing her a little <laughs> bit closer to us. And so God bless you, sweetie. And I love oh, you, Costella. I love you, I love you too, <laughs> sis. All right. Oh. All right. How you all have a that? blessed evening. All right. Man, that's I have my one sister. more caller. <laughs> One more caller, area code 502. Go ahead and state your name, speak. Uh, yes, this is uh, comedian uh, William Sporty T. Hunt. Calling from hey, William. Oh, wow. Hey. Hi. <laughs> hey, I love you. No, I'm listening at your music, girl. That's, uh, you, you sound like Philly Hammer. You got a, you got a wow. melody. You, you right there. You, you, uh, I love you, because I'm an entertainer myself, and... Uh, Thank and I you. got my platform, and I'd be—I would love to have you on my platform. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you—you you give me a call. We have to make that happen. <laughs> yeah, All right. Thank you so happen, much. You know, yeah. All right. Oh, All man. right. Well, we got to move along with on doing what you're doing, young lady. You got it going on. Thank All you right. so much. You—you you give me energy. Yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs> I Thank appreciate you. that. Yeah. Wow. Well, all right, we got to move okay. along. All right, as we move along <laughs> with the show here, um, I would like to ask you, Castella, um, yes. what is uh, your website information, your social media information, 
and where all of your music can be found on any of the music outlets online. Go ahead. Okay. Well, to make it easy, um, you can just visit my website, castellamusic.com, C-A-S-T-E-L-L-A-M-U-S-I-C.com. And on my website, you can find all of the links to all of my other um, social media sites, you know, like Facebook, Twitter, um, Instagram, all of that. It's right at my website. So um, you can find me there. Just go to my website, castellamusic.com. All of my music is available on all of the, the digital music web, uh, platforms, also on mm-hmm. my website. Um, uh, Apple Music, um, Spotify, uh, Amazon, uh, Diesel, all that stuff. It's, it's, it's there. I think it's Deezer. Um, but, yeah, all those um, places you can find it. So really easy. All right. Yeah. Thank you for that information. Um, I want to mm-hmm. play some more music. Um, eventually, I will play some more of your tracks at the end of the show. I would like okay. to play No Ordinary Love. Which oh, is yes. Also one of my favorites. <laughs> so you got to give you. us a brief story behind this track. What is the inspiration behind it? What made you create this song? Okay. Well, Brenda, you should have gave me two hours, girl. We needed more time to talk. Anyway. But um, No Ordinary Love was my the first song that I actually wrote um, and uh, recorded, actually. And um, it's it's actually about uh, the love for my music and everything that was going on um, with me at the time. And uh, it's just, you know, a song about love. I mean, if you you'll change your world around for things that you love so much in the music. Um, at the time was really something that was just life changing for me. And I was just had fallen in love, back in love with the music, um, in love with people that were helping me do my music, you know, my producers and my friends that were there for me. Um, I'm in a group and, you know, those two people, um, Gabe, Gabriel Crenshaw and Charlotte Pope were my, my partners. And we just make amazing music together and Corey and, and Daryl and just, it was just so many people. And so, you know, the song came about, you know, just, uh, um, you know, the dancing in my room, you know, that was, you know, how it kind of came about it. And, uh, and of course, Corey put uh, an amazing track together for that song. That was the first song that he, um, did for me and you know I was hooked <laughs> we became you know he was my partner at that and point. I, I so thought that, that was the newest hit I thought that was the newest hit no oh, no that was actually the the first song that I took the radio um it made it actually up to um number 24 on the smooth jazz charts and okay. um smooth jazz network and actually it it garnered me a um a new uh, an artist of the what was it called? It was a Breakout Artist of the Year nomination yes. for the Blue Jazz Network. Yes. Yes. I and so that, yes. it was for that song that I got that nomination. And um, <clears throat> I can be more more grateful to, you know, Alan Kepler and uh, Smooth Jazz Network for that honor. Um, and also earlier you had mentioned uh, uh, we played Let Me Love You. And for that song, I'm Artist of the Year for the Central Standard Time show. So uh, a lot of honors, you know, going around and, you know, nominations you and awards. for the Indie Soul Awards. <laughs> This year, yeah, and the, you're the newcomer award. of the year, yes, yeah, yep, yep, for that, and um, also um, best female artist uh, for a station over in London. So um, yeah. yeah, just just amazing stuff. But yeah, that yeah. the that was my first song um, that I took to radio. Uh, no ordinary okay. love. Yeah, very All proud right. of it. Well, thank you for that information. We're gonna shut up mm-hmm. right now. Go ahead and play. This is No <laughs> Ordinary Love. Be right back. Right. <laughs> got me dancing in my room. Got me feeling kind of loose. Ain't no ordinary love I feel for you. Got me running all around. Got me feeling like a clown. Kind of feeling like a fool just for you. Ain't nothing I wouldn't do. I wouldn't do. Ain't nothing I Wouldn't 
that is no ordinary <laughs> love. Castilla yes. here tonight <laughs> on my platform. You all call in. Phone lines are still open. And give Castilla a shout out. Now, as we move along, <laughs> Castilla, I'd like to ask you this. What is that ultimate desire which you wish all your fans out there, which you wish for them to get out of all your music, especially the newest single, Let Me Love You? You know, I just want them to feel good. <clears throat> um, feel good. Um, you know, the, the music hopefully will touch their sto- their soul, um, um, that they can get up and dance a little bit, um, and that they just ultimately enjoy it and can feel the, you know, the sincerity in which I've written uh, the songs, that they can, you know, just really get something out of it. And, um, you know, I just want them to enjoy, enjoy the music. Um, it, you know, I have an old school kind of a, a vibe and just you yeah. know, bring back some some good stuff, some good music. I just, you know, just want to touch people. And uh, and also, I just want people to hear it. (laughs) I just want people to hear it. And they hear it. Yeah, yeah. You've been a a thirst for a lot of people. And I want to say congratulations on all of your blessings and your awards. And I want to say thank you so much. Thank you, Castella. Thank Thank you. you. You're welcome. (laughs) <laughs> um, I would like to ask you any other future music projects to come you want to tease us about. Well, sure. Um, <laughs> Let me love you is actually <laughs> Let me love you is the title track to um, my uh, EP that I'm working on right now. Ooh. And Ooh. Um, the next song that I'm actually going to go record. Actually, I just recorded a little jingle that I'm going to put on my EP. Um, that's yeah. going to be out in a couple of weeks. Um, yeah. But. Um, I'm working on a, my next single, um, and uh, we're going to be putting that out. But I actually have the whole thing planned out. We have all the songs planned out and 